Good evening, church. So glad to be back with you for another encouraging word on Wednesday. So it just so happens uh, that it'll be my last encouraging word that I get to do with you guys. Because um, as you know, this coming Sunday will be our last Sunday at Calvary. And it's a bittersweet thing. Hard to talk about. I don't really want to think about it, but um, it's what the Lord has. And so we're just going to follow him no matter what till the stars fall out of the sky. Right. We're going to follow God. Um and it really brings to mind Ecclesiastes, Ecclesiastes chapter 3, where he spends most of the chapter writing and telling us about how there's a time for everything. There's a time to get up, time to go lay down, time to plant, time to sow. There's a time for everything under the sun, right? Um, and God works in seasons. There are seasons in our life where we'll be... Uh, doing certain things in other seasons where we won't um and it's god's plan it's all part of what god has and so uh we'll be moving on to the next season in life but it's god's plan and and it's the same for all of you there's seasons in your life and you have to be willing to follow god in those seasons now in the middle of those times it's a little easier to follow god but the transition in between the two can sometimes be kind of sticky kind of feels that way um, and so as you are transitioning between seasons in your life, because we tend to get kind of in a routine and in a schedule and then us moving into a different part of our life and doing different things, everything gets, everything gets kind of changed up, moved around. It can be scary. You don't know what's going to happen, but God's in control and he's going to take care of it. And like I said, Ecclesiastes, Ecclesiastes chapter three explains to us how there's a season for everything in life. And so, um, as you go through life and you you'll sense it when God is moving you to a different season as you go through different stages in life you just know to follow God trust him and everything will be okay all things work together for good for those who love the Lord and if you love the Lord and you're following him things are going to work out Calvary Church I love you we love you most importantly Jesus loves you and he died on the cross for you and that's our hope we'll see you guys tonight love you